day, everyone, especially to our grade 11 students. I hope you are doing great. Welcome to Gaya on Air. I am Teacher Pedi Kasing, your math amazing mathematics teacher in pre calculus. A sequence is a list of numbers separated by commas, while a series is a sum of numbers separated by plus or minus sign. As an illustration, 1, negative 1 half, 1 third, negative 1 fourth is a sequence. And 1 minus 1 half plus 1 third minus 1 fourth is equal to 7 over 12 is its associated series. It is easy, right? From the illustrations, we can say that the sequence with the nth term a sub n is usually denoted by a sub n. And the associated series is given by a sub n is equal to a sub 1 plus a sub 2 plus a sub 3 plus 3 dots plus a sub n. Now, it is your turn to do guided practice activity. Directions, write as EQ or SEC if the given item is a sequence and write as ER or the SER if it is a series. Number one, the given is one, two, four, eight, followed by three dots. What is the answer? Okay, the answer is SEQ or sequence. Now, you will answer the remaining tasks. Number two, negative one plus one minus one plus one minus one plus one. What is your answer? Very good. The answer is SER or series. Number three. 1 plus 0 0.1 plus 0 0.001 plus 0 0.0001. What is your answer? You're right. The answer is is ER or series. Number four, one half, two thirds, three fourths, four fifths, followed by three dots. What is your answer? Correct. The answer is SEQ or sequence. Number five, five minus four plus eight minus one plus two. What is your answer? Excellent. The answer is is ER or series. Now, let's have independent practice activity. Directions, identify if the given item is a finite sequence, finite series, infinite sequence, or infinite series. Number one, two, four, six, eight. What is the answer? Okay, the answer is finite sequence. Now, you will answer the remaining tasks. Number two, one, five, six, eleven, followed by three dots. What is the answer? Correct. The answer is infinite sequence. Number three, one plus two plus four plus eight plus 16. What is the answer? Very good. The answer is finite series. Number four, negative 10 minus two plus six plus followed by three dots. What is the answer? You're right. The answer is infinite series. Number five, square root of three, square root of four, square root of five, and square root of six. What is the answer? Excellent. The answer is finite sequence. I hope you learned something with our lesson today. Remember that a sequence is a list of numbers or objects which have been arranged in a sequential way. A series can be highly generalized as the sum of all the terms in a sequence. Continue doing the remaining activities in your GIA for more fun math learning. See you in your next lesson. 
This is teacher Paddy Cassie, your teacher on air saying, everything you need comes to you in a perfect time, space, and sequence.